Hello world, I'm LJ and this is LJ Goes Sweden. Today I was actually expecting the day to be better, expecting to do the video somewhere else. Well, it all just didn't work out. Today I took my car to work because I was planning to go to the grocery store after work and then to the supercharger. And there I was thinking about like, yeah, making a nice video, doing a little chat with you guys and just maybe talk about, yeah, my current consumption or whatever that would have come up to mind when I would have been in that situation. However, yes, <laughs> I took the car to work. That's the thing. And I also went grocery shopping. But at work today, it was really an annoying day because today at work things were just not going as I was planning it in my head and mostly the day was actually pretty good. Mostly I was finishing the things that I was telling you in yesterday's video so that was pretty cool to be honest also because one of my work colleagues has put like a speaker there and the radio was just running and I kind of enjoyed listening to music because I'm not a person who likes to put headphones on at work because it I just space out too much out of my work environment. But listening to music when it's like everyone hear, hears it, I like that because you know you can still keep the conversation if something happens. So that was great, really great. Then we had our quarter meeting, so summing up everything, and we got free ice cream, so that was also pretty good. And then, well, I went to Mud Company, so to the restaurant that is close by, as we mostly do Wednesdays, all was being good. However, after lunch, it started to get unexpectable. Like I was not able to expect how long things are going to take. So what happened is basically that I got put on a project that has very high priority, that needs to be done basically as soon as possible. And the colleague who was working on it before, well, he's leaving tomorrow. So today was the last day he could give me information so that I'm capable of finishing it before I go on vacation. And well, it was dealing with a lot of quality and documentation and just things that take forever. And then also there was one of my work colleagues who was leaving now, unfortunately. So we had like a nice little farewell fika with some cake and that was like that was a good thing. But it took away another 30 minutes. It might have been useful for the other things, for like that high priority stuff. And because my work colleague is leaving, of course, he wanted to show me all the things that I need. And it took longer than expected. I should not complain. I was leaving like at quarter past four so that's totally fine but for me I felt like I'm leaving around 3 30 and then I go grocery shopping take my time go to the charger and now I knew like when I go grocery shopping there is not really that much in me that feels like oh yeah now I can chill 30 minutes at the supercharger of course I have said in videos before that I don't have a problem going to the supercharger because I have YouTube and everything on there but today it was something else I needed to figure out how I get the car insurance. I needed to cut the video from yesterday, so the reaction video, and I had nothing with me. My, my laptop was not there, so if I had it with me, I could have cut the video then. There would have actually not been any complaints. I also unfortunately forgot my camera, so I would have done the video on my phone. A lot of things just played into this where I said like, okay, I'm not charging the car today. I will go there on Saturday. And yeah, so I basically went to the first grocery store because I needed to go to do two different ones. The first is the cheaper one, Lidl. The second one is the one where I find other stuff that I just cannot get at Lidl. So it took a while and I was home, I think like half past five. So if I would have went to the charger and I would have like planned to charge the car fully, then I would have been the earliest here at 6, 6.15 maybe. It just didn't feel like the right decision, which is why I skipped it. One thing, however, that kind of got my mood back up is I pushed myself to call Trukhansa, so the insurance company that already is like working together with Tesla in Sweden that also offered me those 14 days of free insurance. I had to talk to them about fixing the... The new mileage, that's, that's one of the things that I'm like a bit curious why they didn't communicate, but 
all good because like they sent me an offer with just 15,000 kilometers per year but I need more when I estimate like taking a few drives to Germany and you know going on longer trips over weekends so I just wanted to set it higher up and I got myself through to call people like to call the customer support and they were luckily yeah available till seven and I really had a nice conversation. But one other thing that I can just tell, the music from Trick Hansa that was playing when you're like in the queue is so chill and so awesome. Like I was really sitting there with my phone and doing like and feeling the beat the whole time. I could have made a reaction just staying in the queue. But <laughs> so that actually made my day and also kind of pushed the positive out of the unexpected events like with work <sighs> and well now i'm sitting here it is already i think it's already after nine to be honest i don't know it is close to nine and yeah i will be going to bed pretty soon i really think sometimes that i get sick because in the mornings i kind of feel like i have a weird feeling not like a sore throat but like you know like this feeling that you want to have like you have a lot of slime or whatever but when i'm done at work drinking tea it all disappears so maybe it is just the air like yeah i will definitely open the window again to get some fresh air in i don't know what it is but we will see the next days yeah and that is it i was actually also hoping that my bank lens for schreikringer who also have like insurance parts that they call me because i wanted to get at least an offer from them regarding my car insurance i don't know maybe they call me tomorrow like i had to make like an appointment that they call me because i don't have a swedish driving license and so i'm not able to do it all online but we will see if they call me and then i can compare between trukhansa and lens for Schäckinger. but i really think trukhansa is in the first year really really cheap and when i have decided on which insurance i am taking i will make the full video about all the expenses everything that i've chosen regarding the car regarding my expectations how much i will be spending on the car all that is coming when i have made the deal with the insurance company yes but now enough said i hope you had a wonderful day and we're going to see each other back in tomorrow's video have a good one bye bye